up guys, this is Saturn here and today I'm gonna show you how to install the Silent Engine Mod 9 on your Samsung Galaxy Ace GT S5830 um, sorry for my weird voice again and please make sure your device is Galaxy Ace GT S5830 otherwise it's not compatible so don't keep asking me upload um, raw review for the other device like the uh, Galaxy Ace Plus, Galaxy Ace GT S5830 but it is not compatible so mm, um, so yeah please make sure it's rooted yeah my baby here is rooted <laughs> um, and install the Cloud Mod Mod 5.0.2.6 the latest one and um, please make sure your battery is over 50% or not I think it will fail to install or install the hardware and then no battery the battery is dead so um, once you have rooted and installed the clock on mod 5 um, you are ready to download the zip file the beta 3 the sienna beta 3 zip file only yeah only and place into your SD cards as you can see um, I already have it um, so you can move to the next step So I already um, placed into my SD card as you can see the CM9 from the Rich Beta 3 big thanks to the developer and they are ready to boot to the recovery so for the others um, st are still in the stock room you can just power off your device and boot to um, the recovery mode by pressing the home button and the power button so yep this is the clock mod 5.0.2.6 um, you're gonna wipe three things oh, the first one is the um, white data and factory set so wipe it and the second one is white catch partition and the third one is go to advanced and wipe the Dalby catch um, this is not unnecessary but I recommend to do that um, so after you wipe the three things you are ready to flash the ROM so you're going to install zip from SD choose zip from SD so locate your CyanogenMod uh, Mod 9 Beta 3 from the edge so just select it and install it so I'm gonna fast forward it so if it's done so you can go back to um, reboot the system so while doing the first boot it will take a long time like, uh, it's about two to three uh, minutes so while doing the first boot I'm going to talk about the features um, the camera uh, is working you can take a picture with preview uh, but um, it doesn't have video recording um, but I recommend to use third party app to record it um, yeah the Wi-Fi the GSM and the Bluetooth is working the hardware acceleration the sensors market um, the backs uh, the backs like the back key and the menu here um, the sound and the um, headphones GPS a GPS and uh, the lock screen animation you know the um, CRT off screen when you lock the screen and uh, ICS keyboard game YouTube but no HQ playing deep sleep Wi-Fi signal indicator Android mass storage auto mount um, live wallpapers FM radio um, yeah obviously it is rooted um, the signal indicator working 100% the torch yeah added torch into it um, so um, let's talk about the box yep video recording as I said <coughs> excuse me as I said use third party app uh, speech to text keyboard I don't know what is the black space issue so I'm gonna do show you in the raw review um, the proximity sensor and the compass uh, and the super user 
uh, can't be updated to the latest one so please keep in mind do not update to the latest version battery set are not available yep so these are the bugs and yeah well I'm still doing the first boot and yeah I I can feel that the phone is bright red and it's gonna done for the first boot yeah set up wizard so this keep in mind this ROM is Cyanogen Mod 9 it is ICS 4.0.4 but I don't really like it actually I still like the Jelly Bean 4.1.2 the ammunition is better than the ICS so I'm gonna skip to sign sign up for the Google um, so type in my name my last name next um, wait sorry next setup complete finish yet um, I don't know why every time I flash the um, signage mod it will appear this thing that I just click it um, I realize that okay it's, it's much smoother than the Macron okay this is a whole so that's it guys like comment subscribe to my channel and um, please be patient for my ROM review and yup see you guys in my next video bye